Hi Elke, <laughs> welcome. Good to have you here. Uh, can you tell us something about yourself? I'm Elke van Raamstonk. I'm a product designer and I work for Trimline Fires. And what did you do for Trimline Fires? Well, um, we started the brand and uh, the brand name, the brand logo, and I designed the uh, graphics around it. Um, and uh, lately I've designed a few uh, uh, freestanding fires. So it's a whole new range? Yes. And uh, what did you start with? What was your first thought when you started creating these uh, freestanding fires? Um, my starting point was of course the fire. Uh, fire attracts, it gathers people around, uh, let them tell stories and share uh, thoughts. If a fire is in your home, it's the central place in your home and uh, people uh, will sit around it for warmth and for coziness and comfort and everything. So, um, yeah, that was the starting point of my designs. Can you elaborate a bit on that? So, you made concepts or what did you do next? Well, I thought of uh, gathering around the fire is uh, one of the starting points, like a campfire that you sit around mm -hmm. it. Um, but also I noticed that a lot of freestanding fires were quite um, uh, static uh, metal elements in your house um, and they do not really connect with uh, the interior of your home. One of the sad points of a freestanding fire is that it's usually off. Mm -hmm. uh, when the fire is on then it's really an attractive uh, site. But when the fire is off, uh, it's not that attractive and it looks a bit uh, dull. Um, so I tried to design uh, a freestanding fire that is part of your interior and also has a, um, a character. Uh, because the interior uh, reflects your character, you have a certain style. And uh, if you have a freestanding fire, then it might be a part of that style. So you tried to add a little bit of Elke's um, style to the to the fire. Mm -hmm. So what is that exactly? Can you explain well, it a bit more? <laughs> I'm a female designer, so it will always have a kind of a female touch. Um, I think the most uh, freestanding fires are really masculine, uh, um, business-like looking uh, fires. And I thought it, it could use a bit of... Um, softness around it. Mm -hmm. And how can we see that? Um, well, the fire has uh, got uh, rounded corners and um, when when I designed uh, freestanding fires I really tried to get the right dimensions of everything to put it totally in balance. And if you see one of the designs now it's also it's it's correct. So now it's in perfect harmony. So um, these fires, do they have special names or are they also called with numbers like the other fires? Well, because we uh, really try to uh, design some characters here for the freestanding fires, we also uh, uh, thought of, of uh, real names for the fires. Also for consumers it's easier to remember a name of a person uh, or a name that gives you an idea of, of an object mm -hmm. um, instead of a, a number, which is fine for uh, built-in fires, but for freestanding fires we decided to do this differently. So what are the names then? Uh, we came up in the end with a series of gemstones, so uh, all the freestanding fires have a name of a certain gemstone. Which one are they? Um, well, we have a model uh, which had a code name before, and uh, its name is now the Quartz. We have the Tourmaline Fire, and we have the Zirko Fire. And can we see them? Of course. So here they are. Yes. Looking very good. So which one is which? These are the fires that we designed. Um, I will start with uh, this one. This is the freestanding model, uh, the um, Tourmaline Fire. It's a panoramic uh, view on a double lock burner with a LED. This fire is a combination of a freestanding fire and also furniture. I will show you. We have a 
underneath the fire is uh, an open area with uh, hoops hidden in the fire. This is the fire variety and uh, this upholstery is the wood variety. Uh, you can hide them in the fire or um, use them to sit on. Um, in this hearth uh, I designed uh, rounded corners uh, here as well and uh, the open uh, part on the bottom is also rounded for a more elegant view on the hearth. These design features we also uh, translated to a second model uh, which is the Zirko. Uh, this is the smallest freestanding fire that we have at the moment. Um, it's a front model with uh, black glass inside, a single burner model and it also has these rounded shapes like the Termaline and uh, an open area in which you can put um, books or wood logs or anything you like. I hope you liked this introduction. If you want more information about the Gemstone series, visit our website.